Hello guys and welcome to my what I got for Christmas video for 2023. So today's video is going to be my what I got for Christmas video and I did do one of these last year and I loved it so much and you guys love just like seeing what I got so I am going to be doing it this year. I understand it always comes with like this stipulation that I'm not bragging in any way. I just wanna share with you guys what I got because it would be in a vlog anyways. So I'm just gonna share with you guys what I got from family and friends and I'm super thankful for getting presents at all. That's obviously not the meaning of Christmas. Ryan and I didn't even exchange gifts this year. Instead, we went to New York City the weekend before Christmas, so that was our gift to each other but my parents do love to spoil us and get us gifts and so do ryan's parents and family friends always get something for us as well so i do have a haul for you guys i have something some something really exciting so let's just go ahead and get into it okay since i can't really hide this and it's like the biggest thing that i got my mom asked me what i wanted for christmas and i gave her two things and then a couple little amazon things i'll show you guys later but this was the main gift and this is oh, a Costco set and this is a Dutch oven, which I'm so excited for because I'm gonna start bread making in the new year and this literally has a picture of bread in here, but it is a two piece set. So there's one that's a 3.5 quart, which is the mini and then a 5.5 quart, which is just a full size Dutch oven. So really excited about that. And these, if you guys don't know, they're cast iron, so they can go, you can use them on the stove if you wanted to make like a soup or something, and you can put it in the oven. So it's really great to be able to have something versatile. And this will be like a lifelong item. It should last me like my entire life. That's the best part about Dutch ovens and cast iron stuff is that it lasts a lifetime. So really happy for that. Thank you so much, mom and dad because I'm so excited to start baking bread, you guys. You have no idea. Okay, and then the other big thing that I asked my mom for are snow boots, which I don't actually own a pair of snow boots. Obviously, I live in Texas, you guys. It doesn't snow here. Um, maybe it snows once every couple of years in the winter time, but I do go on a couple winter trips every year. I go skiing every single year in like February time. So I wanted to get some snow boots because I just never got any. I just use kind of regular boots, but it's really good to have something nice, especially if I'm gonna go hiking or something. So I got these Columbia Ice Maiden twos in a seven and a half. They're so pretty. Like these exceeded expectations. So kind of boring adult gift, but I'm so excited and I can't wait to use these. And these will be kind of my just all around boot. I don't really need to pack a bunch of boots like I usually do. I'll pack like a pretty one and then like one for actually trudging through the snow. This will just be my all together boot because it's super cute. So that is the other big item that I got from my parents. Okay, let's move on to the other stuff behind me. Um, because these are really cool. So we go to a Christmas party with Ryan's family friends every single year. And this year um, we got a beautiful gift. So let me show you the box. This is from Members Mark, which I think might be Sam's Club. I'm not quite sure, but this is a three wick snow globe candle in the scent Gilded Cashmere. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous and so heavy. I'm gonna keep this for years to come. That's why I still have the packaging so I can kind of put it up nicely and it won't break, but it is a glass snow globe and it's got like a little scene in here. It's so cute and it's a huge candle. It's so big. Kind of smells a little perfumey. So just a beautiful, beautiful item. So ah, I can't believe I got one of these. I know they were all the rage this year and last year. <laughs> and then Ryan's parents got this gift set of wine. There's not anything in it, it's just, empty because we emptied it out but they don't drink so we did take this home with us but a three set of wine and I cracked open the Pinot Noir last night to drink and it was really good. Moving on to other family friend gifts. I got this beautiful purse. Look how cute. They called it the Barbie purse. <laughs> it really is like Barbie pink, hot pink. It's got this beautiful little buckle right here. And then it comes with like a long strap so you could have it as a crossbody if you wanted to, but this is just the cutest thing. Uh, and I don't have any like statement purses, so this was really fun to open. So that's adorable. 
And then Ryan's mom, she usually gets uh, PJs for everybody for Christmas. So we got these Old Navy flannel pants and they have pockets. Since when do PJ pants have pockets? That's so awesome. So I wore these to the Christmas party and they were super cozy. And Ryan's mom knows me and she got me a Bath & Body Works gift set in pure wonder. So it's got the fine fragrance mist, the body lotion, and the moisturizing body wash, which I'm always happy to get another one of these moisturizing body washes. They're so luxurious. So I got my pure wonder set and it's really funny because I was using the mini shower gel like on my trip to go visit them for Christmas. So perfect. And then even though we definitely said we weren't getting gifts, Ryan surprised me and stuck this in my stocking. He got me the AirPods Gen 3, I think is what they're called. But mine had been shorting out for the last like month and I've been saying like, oh, I need to buy new AirPods. I don't wanna buy them. And so he bought them for me. So thank you, Ryan, even though we said we weren't giving gifts. And then from my brother's girlfriend, Jesse, she got me a little like pamper set. This is the Prep Set and Glow all-in-one skincare set, and it comes with eye masks, lip mask, right? Yeah, lip mask, and then three different types of face mask. Ah, so cute. I should have broken this out today. I used one of my other Tony Moly eye masks earlier because I forgot that I got this. So I got this one, and then she get me a little manicure set too. It's got like a nice little carrying case too, which is nice because I always seem to lose my um, nail clippers. <laughs> So nice to have a new set because I'm always losing them. And I have to be careful with opening this one because a certain dog that we know thought that it was for him and it is not. So to be very careful not to make too much noise, but this is a snuggle buddy. It's a heating pad. So there's like a little pouch on the back and you can unbutton it. And there's like a little bead thing that you can warm in the microwave. This is so soft and cuddly no wonder why Kai thought it was for him but yeah oh she's so cute I think I'm just gonna leave this on the bed too it's just a cute pillow too and then another little small thing that I asked for from my parents was this beautiful these little earrings everybody is wearing them nowadays they're on everyone's like Amazon storefront but they're so pretty and I love that they came in their own little package but there are these little teardrop earrings look how pretty okay wait I kind of want to try them on now cute so they look like they're like big hoops but they're actually just a teardrop i like those because you can see them from the side still oh my gosh these are cute i'm gonna wear these tonight we're going to happy hour and i'm really excited to wear these ones you guys know me i'm always on the latest trend <laughs> oh and something i forgot because i'm actually wearing it this is probably my favorite thing ryan's mom got me this beautiful sweater it's like super cozy can you tell it's like very soft and this color, it's like this brownie taupe, so pretty. I actually have another sweater like this from Abercrombie that's like split down the middle, one side's white and one side's this color. So I love this color and I've been wearing it all day today. I'm recording this on the 26th of December. And then we got some little stocking stuffers. So from Ryan's mom, she did put some Bath & Body Works goodies in my stocking and in Ryan's, which he doesn't use hand lotion, so he gave it to me. We've got coffee and whiskey and aromatherapy, mimosa and spearmint. That's gonna be nice. I'm gonna put that on my desk Oops. for work so I can use it if I'm stressed out. And then a pink bubble gum. Ooh, wait, pink bubble gum. I'm gonna have to use this. Oh my gosh. That smells so good. Oh, I'm gonna have to put this on for Valentine's Day because that's so cute on my purse. And then in the stars. So she got those for us. And then my mom, she likes to fill our stockings with like candy. And then I asked for a few smaller things from my Amazon wish list. So I asked for some Stanley um, straws. These are clear. The ones that come with your Stanley cup are actually like frosted white. And these I think just look so much better. So I asked for some clear straws and they're plastic. They're not glass, which I was really happy about because I hate, I hate having a glass straw, at least on like my water bottles. So I got some of those and then I asked for these little straw toppers. Oh my God, why are these the cutest thing ever? <laughs> so it came with a pack of five. I got a little rubber ducky. I think this is a little chicken. Oh my God, a little teddy bear a frog oh my 
gosh, and then this little pink bunny. So I thought those were so cute. And it's just nice to have something on top of your straw because sometimes I'll take it to Pilates with me and I will accidentally like kick or like put my foot on my Stanley water bottle, which is gross. So have a little straw topper on there. It also helps with like spillage, so. And then she got us a couple little chocolatey items, a hot cocoa ball for drinking hot cocoa. She got me some hot cocoa spoons cause she knows like I'm all about the hot cocoa when it's cold outside. These are Belgian chocolate. Ooh, I didn't know. These are fancy. And then because she did go to Ikea for something for my brother, she got us these Ikea chocolate bars, which I'm excited to try. This is Chocolade Mork. It's dark chocolate. I just thought that was a cool name. <laughs> so that's everything that I got for Christmas. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said, this is in no way bragging. I just wanted to share with you guys. It's basically like a haul that I do for you guys all the time. And I thought that you would just enjoy seeing what I got. So I cannot wait to break out this Dutch oven. I actually already bought stuff to make bread. Earlier, I went to the grocery store and I bought stuff. So I will definitely be making some this week and I'll update you guys on how it goes. But yeah, that's everything that I have to share with you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know down below what was your favorite thing that you got for Christmas this year and how did you celebrate it? I would love to hear that down below. And as you can see, I actually still have a couple Christmas gifts under the tree to hand out to friends because we didn't get to see them on Christmas. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe down below and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.